Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and I'm doing a nice and early morning recording. We are going to start off a brand new streak today, a brand new streak, and we're going to start it off as Eve. Why not? We'll do a dark path with Eve. Nothing will go wrong. We will be fine. I'll immediately use my active item and probably die because of it, but no. Uh, we'll, we'll just hopefully manage to stick the landing here, but it's kind of crazy to think that once you get the Razor as Eve, she's basically just a better Judas. <laughs> like, she doesn't have the good active, but like, in terms of her damage output, basically just Judas, but better. <laughs> it's kind of crazy how much damage she has. Um, let's try and get our item room first here. But let's move along, move along, move along. As for the question of the day, what would you say is the next step in your life? The next big step in your life? What's, what's sort of the next thing coming for you that you're working towards or that you're trying to achieve? What's like your next big step? I'd say for me at the minute, it's just like getting a house, probably. I'm, I'm still a little ways off of that. I've got some decent savings towards that, but I'm still not there yet. And realistically, both me and my girlfriend kind of need raises from our jobs within the next like six months or so to make it hopefully achievable within the next sort of year or two, but um, we're working towards that. Concussion, it's not insanely good, but it does um, at least act as a pocket active, so we don't have to lose our razor so early, which is rather nice. Okay, now this is a boss I could very easily die to, especially without a bomb. Now, my damage right now is crazy good, so... Oh, god damn it. I don't like this. No! That boss... Nah. <laughs> it's not it, Chief. It's not it. The start of the new streak has gone terribly thus far. The start of the new streak has gone terribly. Uh, I don't know what it is, but I really just cannot even with that, uh, with that boss. Something about it... I know how to beat it, people have told me many a time before. Brain does not compute. Brain does not compute. I just can't goddamn do it. Hey, a soul heart here is fantastic. Okay, much better start this time. See, I was joking before. This is the start of the streak. I was joking before. This is a good item as well to start it off. I like this item. Good stuff, good stuff. I'm trying to beeline the boss right now because we've got, um... We've got all these extra devil deal items. What the hell was that? For one, what, like, why did I have a holy mantle? And for two, what the hell was that explosion? I'm very confused on multiple levels. Does anyone know what just happened there? I am very confused. Oh, bugger. Didn't mean to do that. It's alright, we got it back. We got it back, don't worry. We got it back. But yeah, we got the uh, astral projection here, which is really good. Weird that we got two items from uh, the same mod. Two different items from the same mod there. Concussion and th this from the same mod, I believe. Gold flakes is pretty good. We don't have a trinket right now, but it could give us one. It gave us a golden penny. I'm reasonably happy with that. Oh, really? That was a very pathetic penny there. Uh, right, to the next floor. I'm not going to bother searching the rest of this one. Let us just go. Let us just go. Um, if I can get an extra red heart, then I can go in there with the razor. Although, really, do I want to do that? Because that would waste our golden hearts, I think. I think that would place the golden hearts like in the wrong location. Nice. Breezing through at the minute with this damage. It's good stuff. But yeah, Fiend Folio bosses, still... Really would prefer to have a mod that just disables the Fiend Folio bosses, or at least some of them. There's like four or five Fiend Folio bosses that I really just... Many people know already that I just do not enjoy fighting, especially so early on. Um, but, hey her, it's par pass and parcel with the mod, I kind of have to deal with it, don't I? Nice. Okay, careful of the little burns they throw, because they are problematic for me. Okay, you're just going to run into these fires. I don't know what that's about, but I uh, encourage it. Dude. 
If it hits right, if that, that shot goes the right way, god damn does it do some damage. This is probably one of the only bosses that I find not so bad, but only if it's not the champion version. The red champion version of this boss can, can go screw itself. Because it spawns a bunch of those flies that like... I don't know what the- I don't know how to describe them, but you know what I mean. The flies that are very annoying. There you go, good, good. Um, I definitely want that, but I'd like to remove my hearts first, and there you go. We did just that with a bit of hellfire. Lovely. Getting that huge speed boost outside of combat is really, really nice. I don't know why it gives you a shot speed boost out of combat, though, I'll be honest. The speed boost I get, the shot speed boost I'm a little more uh, clueless on. And Midas Touch here, or we can go for a reroll. I think we ought to try and reroll. Wow, Monstrous Tooth. Wow, sissy. Bomb bag. Come on now. Sack of pennies. Prank cookie. There you go, baby. I'll take a prank cookie any day of the week, and we'll try and buy a soul heart from the shop here. We should also look for secret room, to be honest. Uh, let's just take a little... Look around. Um, I'm not really sure, to be honest. Kind of a tricky one. Kia, maybe? Yeah. Um, okay. Decent. Oh, red chest. Soul hearts. Nope. But yeah, having this amount of speed right now makes me very happy. Um, sadly nothing there for us. Right. Oh, where we go? We are speeding through. Speeding through. Yeah, damn. But yeah, if we get a bad room with a lot of enemies, you know what? Like this one. <laughs> yeah, that's an annoying room. Turn everything into those guys. Um, where did Brother Bobby come from exactly? Oh, he's a, he's a temporary Brother Bobby that we got from the, um... From the card we just used, I see. He's he's not a permanent brother, Bobby. Uh, for, for a hot minute there, I was like, wait a minute. Like, they're just going to give us a permanent brother, Bobby, but I'm pretty sure he's one of the temporary ones that can take damage and die. I'm almost certain. Hellfire doing some good work there. And, oh, really? Double bombs? Come on now. That ain't funny. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, let's be careful now, because my HP is not great. We do just get a lot of money, which I like. If we'd have got a soul heart there, that'd have been way better, but we didn't. Oh, another tinted rock there. If I die in this room now, I'd be so annoyed because there was another tinted rock right there. Right. Hey, that one actually did the right thing. Sack, Dagger, not bad. We've got Chaos of Conquest, so we're getting a lot of champion enemies here. I will press all of these buttons, despite the fact that it could cause us problems. Didn't mean to donate there, but there you go. See, buttons aren't as bad as you think they are early game. Late game, they're literally the most tragic thing in the world. Dude, I cannot hit this guy to save my goddamn life. There you go. Late game, they're horrible because they can spawn bosses. But early game, not so bad. Not so bad. Despite the fact that I got hit there. This is a really horrible situation to be in here. Him being a champion was kind of gross. Okay, made it through that just about. Pinking she is... Annoying, but we got through it. And here, um, donation machines are now dresses. They drop more coins. Beggars grant coins when giving an item. Why not? Nice one. Good bit of extra stuff there for us. Do these guys explode into shots? I can't remember. Yes, they do. And they leave all the poop slick about, so I'm sliding about like a crazy person. I don't like it. I don't like sliding about like this. I love Curse of Conquest, though. It's, it's, it's difficult, but it's good. 
But yes, how's everyone's day going today? Like I said, I'm I'm on an early morning recording today. I've, I've actually um, recently, of course, most of you will know this by now if you watch me regularly. I've been on a, a real health kick recently. I've been doing a lot of running and trying to lose weight and stuff. And recently, I've actually managed to convince my girlfriend to come out running with me as well, which is surprising because she's just not a person that really enjoys running at all. Dude, that charger just absolutely melted that boss. Um, she's not really a person that enjoys running at all, typically. Um, so it's really nice that she's coming out with me because she just wants to help, uh, like, lose some weight as well. And it means we can get up early in the morning and go do something together before she starts work. So we've been doing that uh, the past few days. And it's been quite enjoyable. I mean, I've been really liking it. Um, it's been nice to be able to spend some extra time together because she works a lot. So we don't get a lot of time together. So that's been rather nice, like, way to start our morning. So that's kind of why I'm recording early because I'm, like, actually sort of awake properly. Like, normally, oh, dude. Normally, um, this early, I'm not, like properly awake like I wait I normally wake up around nine o'clock but I'm normally not like awake awake until like um until like sort of ten o'clock Ooh, we got rat poison when used in a room with a visible creator we'll skip it and remove all future rooms by that person intriguing so basically we got a look at the bottom and look for someone's name. Like this one. There you go. Airfly um, creates a lot of rooms. So we have to skip that room and all future Airfly rooms are gone. Which is, like I said, quite a lot of them. So, Dude. That was close. I don't much like you, poopy boy. I'm going to let my crow just deal most of the damage here. Oh, dude, that was so close. I didn't realize you were going to do that. Um, okay. First of all, let's play this bad boy and try and get a soul heart. Damn it. Got a chariot. Just a lot of money. There you go. Oh. Scary times. Scary times. God damn, we need some fire rate increase, really. But yeah, no more airfly rooms, which is rather nice, because there's a lot of those and they're tricky. Small rock was asking for a tears up and a damage up to boot as well, rather nice. Don't particularly mind the speed down. We're still at max speed when we're outside of combat, so I like that. This is a very rough room here. Yeah, take this guy out first. Oh, dude. Didn't expect him to shoot there. Don't know why. Really rough room here. Okay, my, my crow can just deal with him now. Good, good. We definitely need more HP overall, though, here. We are shit in the bed when it comes to HP. Oh, stressful. Stressful times. But yeah, so it's, 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 it's been quite nice. I've been having some pretty good days recently. We need more luck to, to get that triggering more often as well. Um... Really? Two coins? Last time you dropped like ten. Grab that. Oopsie, bounce me straight back in. Still need to see our item room. Let's go back. Head our way back, but with the speed increase, heading back is not a problem. There you go, look. Room has been skipped. That's not going to happen a ton, but it's going to happen enough for it to be useful. Especially considering like that person makes a lot of rooms. Depression. Really glad I came back for that. Now, this is the uh, the caves, right? So, yeah, we want to be searching the floor to see if we get the Steven floor. Making sure we see if we find that. Like I said, with our speed, not as big of a problem. Ooh, I should have bombed into our cash room there. I didn't think about that. 
I need another bomb. Oh, we just found a tainted treasure room there. Nice. I'm not sure what that'll be a tainted version of exactly. We'll give it... Uh, it'll be Horror Babylon, won't it? Yeah. Um. So, instead of gaining our damage and speed, we gain tears, range, and luck while all Red Heart containers are filled. This is kind of a tricky one. Hmm. I don't think I want it. Hey, and we got the Stephen Floor anyways. Nice. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I don't, I don't actually think I want that, you know? Sack Altar? Hell yes. Um, It got rid of... I don't actually know what it got rid of. But really good item nonetheless. Really, really good item. What did it get rid of there? I don't remember. Right. E either way, good item. Gives us piercing, gives us some herming. I was hoping it just get rid of depression, but was not so lucky to remove my depression so easily. Nice. I'll take that. See, the main reason I don't want to take the Horror Babylon alt is that I think there's a good chance that we get another Devil Deal and trade away our Red Heart, and it'd no longer work if we did that. Whereas our damage upgrade always will. Also, we don't have any other damage upgrades right now, so... You're like my ex. Well, mine is the dead bird. Sure was a demon disguise, the Get in here before I change my mind. Yum. We got gompched. See if there's any good item trades for us on this floor. <laughs> no. I'm sorry, my lad. I'm sorry, but that is a big fat no. Charged key. Matter for us, but there you go. Hopefully we get some bombs. We can bomb that guy. Like I said, luckily we got piercing here as well, so it makes those guys a lot easier. Still absolutely love this floor. Really good trinket there. Currently useless for us, but gets a lot better with time. Nice bit of Hellfire there. Definitely seems like Hellfire got nerfed a bit in terms of its proc chance. It's not going off anywhere near as much as it used to. Now I need some bombs to actually get over and check out this guy here. Can you stop raging so I can kill you, please? I don't... I'm not a fan of the rage. You want my small rock? Again, not, not a trade I'm willing to make, my brother. This time around, you've not been so good to me. Previously, you've always wanted my crap items. Now, you're asking for the things that I care about most. It seems like some enemies on this floor, some like basic enemies are re-sprited. Whoa, did that thing... Did that dude just ate that skull. <laughs> Be honest, I'm not exactly sure what's going on right now. We got through it, though. We got through it. <sighs> Bomb there that we can't get to, God damn it. Yeah, he just, like, eats things and then spews it out, look. It's pretty cool. Gotta be careful of all the spewing he be doing. Right, go bomb this guy. Ah, no trade of our deal. 33% chance for it to change our deal. Sadly, he just blew up. Um, oh shit! I was like, what the fuck's going on with this room? And he just picks that guy up, what the hell? That's pretty cool. Let me check out that mini-boss. Is this going to be a regular mini-boss or a unique one? It says it's a mini-boss room, but it's, it's certainly not. So I'm not quite sure what happened there. 
Yeah, these are like regular burnies, but they're respited. Pretty cool. The floor has unique sprites for certain enemies. Weird. Um, Overheal heart skin from heart pickups we left on the ground. Ugh, don't really need that. We need to be looking for our secret room, but we don't really have money. I kind of forget that you should really come to this floor with money, and I didn't. <laughs> We always want to find our secret room last, though. Because the secret room does not stick around. The guy that's selling stuff does not stick around. If you uh, can't afford the stuff there and then. So we, we want to find it last. Boom, boom, bow. Hellfire's doing some good stuff for us at the moment. It's actually triggering more than I, uh, I, I'd expect. Right, this guy is a problem, but I think piercing makes this guy a lot easier. We don't have bombs for this guy, so... I'm not expecting a death, but if I did die, I would not be completely confused as to why. There you go, we got him. We got him. Get us a pretty good item here. Um, I'll take it first and then go in. And we'll take the uh, toy piano here. Get back into Horror Babylon. Right. Try and get a bit more money out of this floor somehow. We don't even have a bomb for our secret room anyways at the moment. Which really low on bombs at the moment. Check back in here, see what was going on. Oh, for f do you know, those enemies, they, they look like set pieces. They look like just like rocks. You want my toy piano? Hell no. It's like, no, go away. Anyways, okay, we can't find secret room in this floor, that's fine. We got the extra boss item out of it, it's uh, guaranteed every time. It's a pretty decent boss item as well. Damage up, a black heart, and um, a red heart, pretty good stuff. And we keep her going. I like that. I like that a lot. Ha ha ha! The brimstone cometh. Chance to spawn a fragile bobby on picking up a coin. That's actually better for us right now. If we get a new method of getting blue flies and the other one's a little better. But right now this is better. Have we done boss rush? We have. So we could... If we can make it to boss rush, we can skip boss rush with the emperor card. We still need to find our item room before doing that though. Dude, our health is so abysmal though. So abysmal. Dude, you didn't have to spew out flies on me, did you now? Right. We got... Um... It's kind of a reroll worthy opportunity here, but we'd need a bomb. I'm just going to take it. Fragile Bobbies, here we come. Nice. Mammoth boy. Again, should bomb him, but we don't have bombs right now. What the fuck just hit me? Our health is real bad. Don't run away from me, you pricks. I don't have time for this. Huzzah, huzzah. Why? Why with this room? Squeezy, I, I need. I know that I'm on a time constraint here, but... Also, yeah, we got a lot of um, fragile bobbies here. I like this. Now, unfortunately, our boss killing potential is pretty slow. Apart from when we get the uh, herming shots of the... What's it called? Dude! How the hell am I meant to dodge that when you're at this angle? I can't. Can't be done. Ah, oh, we got the fucking piss kidney. I hate this boss so much.
Luckily, he's pretty weak. Not a boss I'm particularly okay with. Right. Looks like we've missed Boshra, sadly, because we're just we're slow as hell. Which is a real shame. But I need a squeezy there. For survivability reasons. But yeah, we picked every single way apart from the right way. Which is always very frustrating and apparently incredibly common for me. Does anyone else have, like, really bad problems with always picking the incorrect path in Isaac? Is that something that everyone experiences, or is this is this a very, uh, me problem? Why are we getting so many keys and, like, no bombs? Very, very frustrating. Yeah, boss rush missed by about a minute or just under a minute it'll be by the end of this fight. We're killing stuff reasonably fast, but I've run still not got much of an oomph to it. Didn't even get a devil deal here. We are going dark paths, so we'll take that. And this is going to be rough. This is going to be kind of rough. We've just got to see how this goes, but it's going to be... With, our, with the health we have, it's going to be not great. The health we currently have, it's not amazing. Hey, I wonder if this guy, uh, Airfly, whoever it is, made more rooms on um, certain floors. Because if that's the case, then certain floors, I'm just going to have way less rooms. But it just goes to show how many rooms there is in Fiend Folio and how many people works on them. But it's not, it's happening like a good bit, but not crazy often. See, you've got brimstone. So do we. Is that a bomb? What the hell's that thing? What the hell do I do with that? Some ma oh, dude, that was a crazy shot. I didn't realize he was, like, volleying shots that high. I was surprised by that. Honestly, I don't know why I didn't just use the Emperor card on this floor, but at this point, I'm just going to save it for the next floor. I'd like these spikes to go away, please, so I can deal with these enemies. I'm guessing these spikes don't go away. Another bomb? Holy hell. Nice. Really good trinket, but way too late for it to be useful. Good. Oh my god, some of these rooms are rough, but we're, we're, we're dealing with it. I'm a little worried is all, a little worried. Take you out, big boy. Take you out as well, hell yes. Oh! God damn. God, I'm so glad we uh, got a sacrificial altar and got uh, Eye of the Occult. Is it Eye of the... No, it's not Eye of the Occult, is it? It's Eye of Belial. Really good. So many eyes of and various eye-based items. It's hard to remember. Hard to keep a track of it all. Nice. Boss time. It is unfortunately the hardest version of Loki, but... This, this version of Loki does get a lot easier with piercing, but he's still got herming, which, as you can see, hit me pretty easily there. Latch key is very useful here for the HP. Unfortunately, 
not much we can take here. I would like to take all of those. Dude, are you kidding me? I just accidentally used my Emperor. I literally fat fingered it while trying to go down to the next floor. What a, like, I needed that so bad. What a waste. What a waste. That's so frustrating. Did you drop a soul heart? Wowee. Okay. Maybe maybe it was worth doing these rooms. As long as I don't get hit on any subsequent room towards the boss. Sack dagger just saved me a little bit there. Dude, that guy with the smashy head. Scary. I guess I'll play this out and try and get a soul heart. Didn't think so. That's a lot of pennies. It's going to be a lot of temporary brother bobbies, right? Actually, not as many as I was hoping. I only got three. I just got really lucky before, I guess. Nice. Rage Heart, nice. Some skill, um, fade, fading damage. Oh, dude. Walked right into that. That was really stupid of me. I mean, it doesn't help when I'm like this low HP and I keep playing bad. But to be fair, this is also just one of those runs where I feel like I haven't really squandered a lot of HP. I've had runs where I've got hit way, way more than this. I just I just really haven't been given a lot of HP. The opportunity to, to, to build HP has not been... Like, I've not, tra I've not traded a ton away on Devil Deals. I've just not got many, like, HP drops. Oh, dude, that's a really bad hit. Really bad hit. So we are at the point of the run where it's certainly a bit of a oh shit moment. We will try our best. Okay, I was wondering if because this is an FI room wouldn't spawn bosses based on how that just did like did the little wave effect. But it didn't work. Okay, we got lucky with that. Not an item we particularly needed, so that was a huge risk, but still. Toy Piano's doing a decent job here as well. Keep this guy pushed away from us. Again, keep this guy pushed away from us. Back over this way we go. God damn, yeah. It's been a scary old time. Scary old time. Building up the streak again has not been so easy. Don't like this room. That room was a bit freaky. Some rooms have been like absolute cakewalks, and others it's like, God damn, I fear so heavily for my life right now. <gasps> that was close. I just beelined it for the chest. That was very close. Imagine dying to a mimic chest on this run. Come on now. That would be some silly. That would be a silly and danger. A lot of brimstoning going off. I don't really have one look that's popping off quite a lot. Right. See how this goes. God damn it, I managed to push my bomb miles away there. Sack dagger, I kind of need you to save me. I'm also using my brother Bobby's to save me as well. There you go. Down we go. Wow, this is... I'm surprised we're still alive. 
We are trying our gosh damn best right now. Dude, why would you rage this enemy? Don't rage the enemy that I need to die, like, now. Can't. Can't do it. Come on, Airfly. Make all the rooms we step into. Please. Get out of my face, you. That's a reflected bomb I heard the noise. This This is on another level of, of horrible. That was that was close. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry my commentary's not really on point today, but I'm stressed. This is a stressful ass run. Right, we have some protection now. Only a very mild amount, we have some. That was... yeah. <laughs> that was bad. At least we survived it. At least we survived it. <gasps> he gave me another half soul heart. Yes! Keep this moving, keep this trainer going. Oh, dude. That was rough. Now, blue boys here. They're going to be problematic. What the fuck? Does anyone know what hit me there? I didn't see what hit me. Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. We are having a rough time after our streak here. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next one.